Good morning, teachers and students. I'm Brianna Barha. And I'm Chloe Barrowet. Welcome back to Mass News Middle School Edition. Today is Wednesday, December 12th, and Mass News starts now. Creative, original, innovative, inventive. The Summer Selected Habit of Mind is showcasing creativity. While we often focus on how our students demonstrate creativity through their magnets, there are many ways that our teachers here at MASH showcase their imagination on a daily basis. Hi, my name is Janae Ureña, and you're watching MASH Teacher. All teachers here at MASH demonstrate creativity in their own way. Some show it through their classroom, through their teaching, and even through their homework and projects. Teachers provide tools and training to students to enable creativity. They allow students the opportunity to express their artistic talents. How they are going to be in there and kind of envision their future selves is a great way to infuse that. Or whether it's creating college pennants to get them excited about the schools that they're going to be going to. And I just tend to be a very creative person, so I decorate for the different holidays. I try to put things in the room that bring life to the room, whether it's quotes, whether it's things to infuse color, and to always kind of push them to think outside the box. Well, I feel like students are already inherently creative. The best thing I can do is offer them techniques to help channel that into something that's not only fun, but something useful for them. So instead of just doing uh, still lifes or landscapes or portraits, I try to have them or encourage them to do projects that involve more imagination. Whether it's planning a lesson, decorating their classroom, or pursuing and improving upon their craft, our math teachers play an important role in the supporting and modeling of their students. Whether it's coming up with creative solutions to your problems, to incorporating your own creative flair in everything you do. Thanks for watching. My name is Sanaya Ureña, and now back to Newsroom. The holiday season is here and people are happy to show off their artistic skills. Today here at Mass, we will be challenging students' creative abilities. Hi, I'm Maria Serrano reporting for Mass News. Students will be given four random materials that they must incorporate into a festive creation that embodies holiday cheer. They will be given three minutes to create their masterpiece. Hi, my name is Lucas. I'm in seventh grade and I'm in law. What's up dudes? My name is Dante. I'm in the 8th grade and I'm in the tech magnet. Two, two go. Oh god. Ah. I mean I'm talking, what the hell? No I'm not, but it's still. Oh, this is gonna be beautiful. Don't you guys worry about that because I am an artist. Looks like Mr. Potato Head. See that? Artistic skills right here. Let's do it. I'm the next Picasso. I'm warning everybody here. This show was an interesting challenge. Once again, I'm Maria Serrano reporting for Mass News, signing off. Back to Newsroom. Creating, imagining, and innovating are one of the many habits of the mind. When using these habits, there are many methods students can use to illustrate these traits, such as photography, writing, and art. We all strive to practice these skills in our day-to-day -day life as they bring us joy and help us work out our mind. One of our very own Mass students exemplifies these traits in the form of art. Good morning, teachers and students. I'm Natalie Torres, and this is Mass News. As some of you may have noticed, there are many posters around your teacher's classrooms displaying the habits of mind, thinking flexibly, striving for accuracy, and this month's topic, creating, imagining, and innovating. These habits are skills that everyone can use to train their mind to fit and become successful young adults. Olivia Santa Maria, a seventh grade broadcasting student, shows these skills in its entirety. My dad was a huge influence because he's an artist, so that was what influenced me to draw. I learned to draw when I was around two or three years old. My favorite subjects to draw is anime and just like anything cartoon based and figures. I've been drawing for at least 10 years. I took a break in around first, second grade. Um, markers, but I tend not to use colors, so I just leave it in pencil. 
We should all strive to innovate and use our imagination when working on different projects. Whether it's an essay, a science project, or just engaging in a activity, being creative allows us to stand out from the crowd and use our imagination. Thanks for watching. This has been Mass News. Now back to Newsroom. With the holidays right around the corner and it's time to wrap up those gifts, here's a challenge that our own Mass team put together. The rules are simple. There will be two contestants. Each will have two minutes to wrap as many boxes as possible. The one with the most boxes wrapped in the end is the winner. Two, one, go. <laughs> she doesn't want to cut me. Shh. What the hell? This isn't even fun. <laughs> One minute left. The holidays are a very cheerful time of the year, especially when thinking about all of the holiday movies. Whether you're watching with family or friends, the holiday movies will always be there to put you in the spirit of the season. My name is Manuel Fraga, and you're watching Mass News. Netflix was launched in 1998, but has quickly become one of the top streaming services. Ever since 2007, they've been releasing holiday movies around this time of year. Some films are Netflix originals, and others are movie classics like How the Grinch Stole Christmas. One of my favorite holiday movies to watch that's on Netflix is um, How the Grinch Stole Christmas because I always watch it with my family every Christmas, like every Christmas day whenever we finish um, unboxing our presents and everything like that, we always watch a movie afterwards. So it's always like a marathon of movies on Netflix. Whether you're traveling or spending time with family and friends over the winter break, holiday movies will always be here to keep you in the Christmas spirit. My name is Manmo Fraga, and you're watching Mass News. Now, back to Chloe and Brianna. Thanks for tuning in to Mass News. Make sure to go subscribe down below if you haven't already, and follow us on Instagram at Mass underscore News. I'm Brianna Barha. And I'm Chloe Barouette, signing off. Yes,